Thank you, Mark. I would like to share with you some of my thoughts and memories of your years of service at Islington United, Islington United Church. I remember when my mother, Doreen Raymond, told me that you would be taking over at the church. Although I do not remember what the first sermon that I attended was all about, I do remember it being inspirational. And I also remember a little bit of humor there, something I can relate to. Most church services you see I'd been to are, well, a little dry. My wife and I had the privilege of you officiating our marriage in 1995. That was an emotional day for me. Needless to say, I didn't have both oars in the water. When my wife attended, when my wife entered the church and the organ was filling the church with the processional music, I was mesmerized. The organ mesmerizes me, it isn't in United. My brothers all turned around on cue and I was rocking back and forth, much the way I am now, on my heels. And I was standing right in front of you and you're looking down at me and you did one of these deals. You gotta turn around. I, I, I thought that was funny. My wife, Alka, and I heartfully thank you for performing the ceremony. You also baptized our three children, Joran, Derek, and Rianne. All very special times held dear to our hearts. We sincerely thank you for that. You also performed the marriage ceremony for my brother, Bill, and his wife, Joan. He was, a, he was in better control than I was at his wedding. You also baptized their children, Billy, Alex, Christopher, and Andrew. On behalf of Bill and Joan and their, and their family, a heartfelt thanks for performing that, those ceremonies. I remember one of your sermons, at one of your sermons, a fly buzzing you in the pulpit. After a few swats while you're, while you're talking, you raised both arms and loudly declared, Be gone! I believe the fly got the message. I recall my family attending church the Sunday after 9-11. We were all affected by that tragedy. My boys were asking me questions that I couldn't answer. Um, why, why would somebody do that? Your words delivered much comfort that day, Mark. Last May, my father passed away. The, the whole Raymond family sincerely thanks you for your support during, during that time. We won't forget that. Back to the humor. The sermon that you gave at my father's funeral was just beautiful. I know dad would look down and he'd be smiling. Your sermon a couple of weeks ago was about saints, so something was said about Pope Mark. So I thought, is it Pope Mark and his bishops, or is it Mark Aitchison and Jeff Foxworthy? Uh, wrong church, but I think you get my point. Can an inspirational minister and a comedian be said in the same sentence? I think so. Mark, thank you very much for all you've done for the Islington United Church and our, and our family. Enjoy your retirement, and to quote you today, what's next?